Well, hello and welcome to my very first Let's Play The Sims 3. Um, this uh, first episode is going to be a uh, small introduction of what I am planning to do. Um, and maybe we'll do in the future with this whole brand new YouTube channel. Um, guys, I'm actually quite nervous um, and also very excited to actually uh, start this and I'm very, very, um, well, I, I really want to get this um, <laughs> tiny movie out there. Um, so yeah, this is um, it's going to be my Let's Play channel and I currently play The Sims 3 and what you are looking at at the moment is um, a, a, the custom world of Jericho made by SimSample. It's actually a world I love very much. It's a world uh, I keep coming back to. Um, I've played it several times and I really love it. Um, it reminds me a lot of Glasgow my boyfriend and I visited Glasgow when we were on vacation many years ago. It reminds me a lot of that. It's lovely. Um, I'm also using a lighting mod by Joan Schnitzel, the California Day lighting mod, because Jerigo gets very dark at 3 o'clock in the afternoon and that's great because it um, it adds to the atmosphere, but um, yeah, it's it's very dark. I can't see my own sim, so yeah. You guys have to excuse me, I am a Dutch simmer and therefore my accent is horrible. Not only that, it's, well, obviously not my native language, so it's kind of hard to, I don't know, no, I have to get used to uh, babbling to you guys and thinking what I want to say and stuff like that. So what am I going to do and why am I in Jericho, guys? Um, that's because of this young lady. This is one of my sims. Her name is Bo. Maybe you pronounce it as Boo, but I prefer Bo, like Bo in Jericho. Um, Bo um, moved only recently to Jericho with her cat Babe. You can see over here in his uh, in this his little portrait of her little portrait over here. I'm so sorry, babe. Um, because, um, well, Bo um, just left her parents' house. And I'm going to post about all that on my sim blur, but she just left her parents' house and wants to go to art school. And what better town to go to art school than grungy, arty, alternative Jericho? So that's the place she wants to be, um, where her parents won't be looking over her shoulder. Bo uh, is living in a dorm, a very lovely dorm. It's a bohemian dorm I actually downloaded a few decades ago from the Sim Resource. Um, I'll do a further introduction when I come to it, but um, um, right now I'll do it swift, quick, quick and dirty. So this is Bo. She doesn't know all these people over here. Um, she's actually new in this dorm. So are all the other uh, Sims over here. They are all wanting. Uh, they are all uh, wanting to go to art school. Um, not all of the Sims are actually I made selectable. And this one here is actually not selectable. She always so, I'm sorry, she's playing bass for like hours, and that's a bit exaggerated. So, let's see, master controller, um, advanced, why am I doing this, guys? Really, I wanted to do an introduction. I'm going to make her selectable. Come on, honey, stop playing bass. So, yeah. Um, I actually deleted, in this part of Jericho, I actually deleted a lot of the villas which were standing here to be able to play some university lots. Um, so where am I? So I placed this university made by my sim reality or my sim reality, I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, and I 
plunk down a few lots from uh, the the beautiful city custom town named Venden, um, like this little square over here, um, but also this lovely nerd shop over here. I hope it will render uh, fast so that you can guys uh, admire it. It's a very nice build. This is actually a girl's dorm, the apartment where a few girls are uh, are living at the moment. In the background, guys, you see beautiful Jericho rendering or not. All right. <laughs> um, there's this other lot from Fenden I actually stole. Uh, it's a lovely lot. It's actually a little bar. I have to refurnish it. It's not finished yet. I want to make a little alternative bar uh, from it. Uh, how do you say that? Yeah. So this is also not rendered. There is some idiot in his pajamas doing really weird stuff. But this is also a small basement where Sims with the aspiration to uh, form a band or um, with the uh, virtuoso trade can actually practice. So I'm really looking forward to um, refurnish uh, this lot. And over here, actually, I want to show you guys, there's also a really, really, really nice lot. I think I also downloaded this one. Oh my god, someone is getting ill. It's getting the flu. Let's see. Yeah, one of the roomies uh, from Bo is getting the flu. Is having the flu, actually, or an allergy. It's spring, actually, guys. So yeah, this is also a very, very nice lot. Uh, I discovered it in my library. Oh, look at that. Um, it's a nice day, actually. So that's that's great. It's not too gray. Um, it's a little street with all kinds of lovely houses. And there's a little barista bar in it. It's really nice. And there are also uh, quite a few students living here. And what I want to do with Bo living in excuse me, um, a uh, bohemian dorm is that, well, it's her student time, you know, and she is going to make new friends, she's going to make new enemies. I made quite a few sims gay or bi curious or uh, bisexual. <laughs> oh. um, because I like. Um, all kinds of stuff to happen, relations to form, um, Bo to discover stuff and all kinds of intrigues to happen. The dormies, the roomies she's actually living with all got their uh, peculiar trades to make that happen. <laughs> As you can see here right in the top there's, uh, what's her face, uh, Dilly Pigeon. You know her from Twinbrook. She's one of the EA Sims I actually like. Um, she lives in Jericho with two of her teen sons. During this uh, Let's Play, I will actually, I always do that um, while playing, uh, rotate households. Um, not all the households uh, which are living here because I plunk down quite a lot of townies because I want my towns to be vibrant and lively. Um, I won't be playing Dilly Pigeon and her two teen sons, um, but I will be playing some other households, which, which I'm going to show you. They are actually living... Oh my god, my accent is horrible. You have to bear with me, guys, or please bear with me. It's, it will get better over time, I promise you guys. Oh look, they are at home. That's really nice. No, they are not at home. They are actually visiting the, the gallery. So stop. I'm going to show you this little neighborhood which I really really like. Why is that? Well, because it's some kind of um, not really run down but it's an old railway station and um, it's now a gallery. And you, as you can see, the um, here are those wonderful houses, really lovely houses. I hope they will render pretty fast so I can show you. But maybe you're familiar with uh, Jericho. It's been on the markets or downloadable from Mod The Sims quite a while. And um, uh, look over here how lovely this is. 
I love custom worlds, guys. I'm a real fan of, of custom worlds. I should make one on my own. <laughs> but I haven't got much time. I really am a weekend player because I got quite uh, a busy job which takes a lot of my time and um, well when I get home in the evening I'm pretty tired um, the lot or the house um, you are look looking I'm sorry looking at right now yeah you will go to university but not uh, the way you think you will I will do that via NRS mods, but I will come to that later. Um, this house you are actually uh, looking at. Look how nice this is. Look how lovely and grungy everything is. It's really nice weather. We're in luck, guys. Um, this is actually the house of Tegan. And I definitely am going to play this household. I actually want... Um, them to come home so that I can introduce them properly. They got two cats, yeah, they got two cats and one dog. Um, make active. Make active. Make active. <laughs> right. So this is Butterscotch, one of the cats, one of the lovely cats. And this is the lovely house, and I will put the walls up so you can, well, not really, anyway. I want them actually show yourselves guys, teleport, teleport and Quincy the little boy, teleport, play, oh yeah. Look, here they are. I Actually, I got autonomy, uh, their free will, a bit lower so that I can uh, control them. Yeah, Tegan is actually ill. Oh, Quincy also has to teleport. Oh, there he is on his bike. <laughs> That's really cute. So there they are. This wonderful family. And uh, go down. Come on. Yes. Oops, beautiful flowers. Pixel flowers. Here we are, this lovely family. Um, and here we have them. So, I'll look at their traits. This is Quincy, their little boy. And here he is. Oh, I'm sorry. Yes, here he is. And this is his mom, Tegan, and that's his dad, Isador, or Isador. I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, his mom, Tegan, is actually quite the cook. She is a natural born cook. And what I want to do, and what her aspirations are, her, her lifetime wishes, um, is actually uh, start a container restaurant in Jericho. Um, she did that once in uh, before, I have to say, in, uh, in Venden. She had this food truck uh, she made from, of I, or I made, from a caravan, a really lovely caravan made by Ruby Red Sims. And now she is up and coming and she is going to open a container restaurant over here, which I am going to build or make. Um, and with this restaurant, I want to uh, use the mod by I Caris all sorts, um, which enables her to actually create her own dishes and um, well, and her husband uh, Isador or Isador actually, um, uh, how do you say that? Um, planting them. Or how, I don't know how to say it. How, uh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh my god, she's going to sneeze. I deserve that. I see that I don't like his trades here. He hasn't got, he lost his trades, uh, green thumb, while uh, transporting them to Jericho. So I'm going to change that. Um, change. Um, loves the outdoors, will be green thumb. Oh, did I tell you that? Yeah, I told you I'm a Dutch simmer. Hence, everything is in Dutch. Um, I guess because our ISD, no, sorry, our SSD disk is getting quite full that we have to buy a new one and then I have to reinstall the Sims 3 
again. I oh, I totally hate that. I totally hate doing that. But I have to reinstall um, this again so that um, and when I do that, I will make it uh, English. Um, maybe it's possible to actually. Um, Yes, oh, bless you, girl. Um, maybe it's uh, possible to actually. <laughs> I have to change her fur and stuff of butterscotch. Oh, yeah, hi, there you go. Do something nice. Um, like uh, pay attention to her or give her some treat. Um, but yes, so what was I saying? Now I lost it. Okay. <laughs> Oh gosh, I don't know, but I'm going to uh, do this restaurant thing with her. Start a culinary career, definitely. No! Why do you want to be more muscled? Actually, he is going to grow. That's it. That's the word. He is going to grow all the stuff she needs, like steak plants and stuff. Look, there we go. Career politics. He's actually a stay-at-home stay dad, guys. Um, No, talk to your son. Do something really funny like that okay so I want to show you the rest of this neighborhood actually they got a very nice neighbor which is a, a grunge sim a loner, loner grunge sim Sophia Rose is her name and she's living over here in this nice house which needs a lot of work with her cat and I'm going to show you the other lots and the other uh, residents of this hood um yeah so this lot you are actually looking at it will as it will render is a lot by cyclone you see I'm sorry if I am pronouncing mispronouncing um, his or her name but um, he or she is a well-known creator uh, on the sim resource and the stuff he or she makes is absolutely gorgeous as you can see um, at this um, rendering lot. This is actually an old train station and my really troublesome youth, two youngsters are, <laughs> are living here and I'm seeing that they have stuff I don't want on the lot like this. Um, and we don't want to sink because I'm going to make their life very hard and I don't want to shower or a bathtub. Um, so here are uh, two guys living um, with their dog um, for the sake of the time of this introduction which is taking a lot longer than I plan to um, but they are um, yeah, well, there are sims with a lot of problems, um, and I'm going to tell you and introduce uh, you to them later. Um, here we have their lovely neighbor, and she looks ridiculous in this outfit, and I don't know why. Outfit daily. These are the Gypso sisters, and I posted about their lives on my Simbler. This is, um, this is, oh my god, <laughs> this is Dixie, and Dixie went to art school, art school, I'm so sorry, in Venden, but it was a total failure. Um, she isn't actually very good at painting and all that kind of stuff, but she really wants to be artistic. So, um, she's also kind of a loser type really sad person um, and uh, I was thinking to actually make her a museum curator or something so that she can enjoy other people's work she lives here with her sister who is now a young adult and her sister is called Sunday and Sunday is quite a mischievous girl Sunday is also going to art school and um, she's by curious she by curious as well so that um, she is able to ruin a lot of <laughs> people's lives and relationships because she is mischievous and she doesn't care um, and f flirty and she doesn't care if she is um, breaking people's hearts and I'm really looking forward to breaking other sims hearts with my lovely Sunday Gypso 
Okay, so the last lot I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to do some movement in this video so that you so that you have something nice to look at. This is a lovely lot by Tidal Sims. Tidal Sims made a shabby apartment as it is rendering. You can uh, look at it. The um, in this shabby apartment there are uh, a few four girls living. And these are my mean girls. They are also the anti-social type. <laughs> um, and they're sort of a gang, you know, and with different characters, with a dominant one and a, um, you know, uh, anti-social person and a, sh and, well, anyway. So they are living here and um, I'll probably also play them and I am also hoping that my troubled guys living over there my bohos or how do you say that? my hobos my hobo sims um, will actually fall in love with some of them and those girls will have a bad influence on my hobo sims and um, <laughs> as I'm going to round this one up I also want to show you the following because I have some sims with problems you know in my hood and I uh, deleted the hospital in uh, Jericho and plunked down this gorgeous lot also by uh, Cyclone News um, from the sim resource you know the one I was talking about earlier this is a lovely factory which I hope will render so that you can enjoy um, looking at it. Um, living in this factory are some really arty farty sims. They will also go to art school. I will probably won't be playing those but there comes a time I will be playing sims who are actually living in this gorgeous lot. Look at it. Oh, I love this stuff guys. I love grungy stuff. I don't know. Look at this. Picture, voila! And um, look at this clock. I love it. So I deleted the hospital, actually, to be able to have my own social work clinic. This over here used to be the base camp of uh, Jericho. Um, Sim Sample actually built in honor of Twalan. Uh, it was the Nathaniel Ra's uh, base camp. Now it's the Nathaniel, oh, what's it, what's he called? Yeah, Nathaniel Ra's clinic. And I placed the rabbit hole uh, hospital rabbit hole rock in this clinic so that our psychologist can actually work here and work on some really troubled minds of some of the Sims that are living in. All oh, these colors are gorgeous. Look at that. Look at that as it is rendering. Isn't it beautiful? I love it. Um, so yeah, and uh, maybe I will, as you can see, here is, uh, oh gosh, what is it called in, um, no, in English? I actually forgot. But um, yeah, I want social workers actually to be able to work here, a few social workers and a psychologist and I will refurnish it and stuff like that so my men, my uh, anti-social sims will come over here to have their talks or whatever uh, <laughs> guys um, I am going to change quite a few things here in Jericho because I love doing that building a hood as we go oh look how beautiful this is isn't this beautiful this is beautiful as as it is rendering. Is it rendered? Picture. No! Oh my gosh! It wasn't rendered entirely. Look, this is actually working. But fountains didn't work in The Sims 3. Again, beautiful. So, I'll let you enjoy um, the gorgeous view of Jericho. As I'm closing this one up,
and in episodes to come I will uh, show you what I want to change in Jericho. I got lots of plans. I also got plans for future Let's Plays um, like I have a sim who wants to be a pediatrician and I'm going to move her to the big city and with Zerbu's mod, uh, career mod, I um, want to let her become a pediatrician, is that what you call a pediatrician, pediatric nur nurse or a pediatric doctor? Doctor, I'm not sure. Um, oh! <laughs> oh gosh, yes! Are we rendered? Ooh, yes! Beautiful! So as we are enjoying this gorgeous view guys, I'm going to round up this this uh, introduction that actually took me 20 minutes. I hope you enjoyed it and please please bear with me as I'm um, um, being clumsy and stuff like that. Um, I hope you kind of enjoyed it and I hope to see you again uh, on the next episodes and thank you so much for watching and hope to see you soon. Bye bye guys!